All right, scattered showers out there. Not anything that's heavy up in northeastern Colorado. A couple of warnings way down the southeast part of the state, but nothing for us to worry about here. And let's take a look at what that one looks like right now in Fort Morgan. There we go with our exclusive Viero camera looking north from Fort Morgan. I saw a couple of flashes of lightning a bit ago, but this is a, a fairly light shower. They're going to get heavier. <laughs> Sorry, cooler Thursday and Friday with rain and thunderstorms on the way. You can leave the sprinkler systems off for a while, folks. We've had a lot of rain in the last week. It will turn warmer again for the weekend. It was a nice warm day today. The high temperature reaching 77, which is five above the average high, well shy of the record of 91. Our low was 52 and no rain out at DIA so far today. Right now, we are at 77. It's 76 downtown. The barometer's falling. Winds are out of the east at 8. Widely scattered showers and storms expected will drop to 57 by 11 p.m. Here comes the cold front that's going to move in here and bring us a better chance of storms for tomorrow and Friday. Cooler air slipping into the state. Scattered storms up across Nebraska and extreme eastern Colorado even in the morning tomorrow. Lows will be upper 40s to low 50s. We'll see 30s and 40s expected in the mountains early in the day and uh, mostly cloudy. Then by midday, starting to get some scattered showers developing, and in the afternoon, there'll be more widespread showers and thunderstorms. A few, especially east of Denver, could turn briefly severe. We'll keep an eye on that for tomorrow. Just in the 60s tomorrow with 50s expected in the mountains and across the state. Uh, still in the 70s to the south and east of us and near 80 out west because that front doesn't get through there. But here's what happens as we head into Friday. We're still on the cooler side of the front. Storms likely. Fewer storms Saturday starts to warm back up a little bit and still a few storms because with so much moisture in the soil, there's a chance almost every single day. Showers and cooler the next two days, a few storms over the weekend, but let's focus in on that rainfall coming up over the next 24 to 48 hours and there's a lot of it coming our way. Another half an inch to three quarters. Again, you can leave the sprinklers off, folks. We don't really need to use that water yet. Next week, 70s, maybe an 80 on Tuesday, and storms likely again coming up next Wednesday. We'll be right back.